Hey everybody, it is your boy, Tyler McVicker, Valve News Network. How you guys doing today? Today we are going to be taking a look at some of the content that is currently available on the Half-Life Alex Ooh. Workshop. Play it, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime, remember Twitch Prime is free. We're going to be playing through some of these Half-Life Alex uh, custom maps, custom created things. Uh, and my favorite thing that actually has been added lately is this right here. The Black Mesa Glock 17. This is the first weapon replacement mod that I've seen be put up on uh, the workshop. And in fact, it is the first weapon replacement mod that I have seen. This is... Uh, uh, this replaces the pistol with the Glock 17 from Black Mesa, complete with custom animations, custom Why sounds. It even works with uh, all the upgrades. Um, yeah, it's really crazy. Yeah, it, it's really, really cool how this works. Uh, we're going to take a look at it. It replaces the pistol in any map. As long as the add-on is enabled, any map that you play with this Glock 17 will replace your pistol with the Glock 17. So, uh, through all of these maps, we're going to be playing with the Glock 17. Is it a new weapon or a reskin? It's technically a new weapon replacing the pistol slot. Um, the ability, it also replaces what the ammo looks like. You'll see. Um, there's also a lot of other really good stuff that's in there right now. Let's take a look at um, what I'm subscribed to right now. Uh, definitely not taking a look at everything that's here, but uh, we will be playing quite a bit of it. I do have a video planned um for the first week of june uh right there the first great mods from the half-life alex workshop as part of the uh half-life alex community showcase very happy with that um there's a lot of v-scripting early v-scripting stuff being done somebody is porting in a workable hev suit uh, which is very interesting. There's a lot of cool stuff going on. Of course, also, while all of this is going on, we also do have um, Artifact 2.0 to be paying attention to. Uh, I did kind of hack my way into uh, being able to play it in, in a really roundabout way. And um, I've been doing a lot of um, searching throughout the build that exists and, and content that exists within the build. Um, something that's going on within uh, Artifact 2.0 that I'm a massive fan of is kind of how Valve is reinventing the way of telling a story. Uh, you know, even through something as, as simplistic as a card game. Um, we'll be taking a look at that in a little bit, but in case you're unaware, uh, in Artifact 2.0, the beta, um, most of what you see is placeholder artwork. A lot of the new cards have placeholder artwork. So here's, look at all this shit. Look at the, look, look at, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. What the hell is this? What is all this? Look at this ability. Good God. Anyways, let's get into VR, shall we? Um, we're gonna start uh, like normal. We're gonna be playing in Half-Life Alex, of course. We are gonna turn the music off. We are gonna turn the camera off. And we are going to switch over to the HMD microphone. I will be buying a much better lapel mic um, very soon. Is Artifact 2.0 any good? It's actually quite good, but I also thought Artifact 1 was quite good. So don't fucking listen to me. All right, let's, let's strap in. All right. Um, in this stream, we will be experimenting with using the new update to Desktop Portal, uh, and a new piece of software to allow me to um, read the chat while strapped into virtual reality. The previous version that I was using appeared to actually have some performance problems um, there you go. Also, I found my Apple Watch. I don't know if you care about that, but I did find my Apple Watch. All right. Can you guys hear me? 
Can you can you hear me? Yes. Okay, cool. All right. Um, so I am in VR right now. You're not going to be able to see it because I do not have Display Mirror turned on. Um, so we're going to turn on Half-Life Alex so that you can, you know, see something. And uh, yeah, so let's get going. Let's get into Half-Life Alex. I have been playing Half-Life Alex nonstop since it came out, and I'm happy. <laughs> I have no problem with it, to be honest. All right, so you uh, should be able to see that. Can you see the, uh, this? All right. Half-Life Alex. But now, when that new update, thank you guys, it just goes right to that. Of course, we're going to turn it down to medium settings. And now, um, we're going to actually turn what you hear from the game down to about 70%. There you go. And now what we're going to do is launch this new piece of software, this desktop portal, while we're in game. Browse all, install, desktop portal, go, because it's an overlay so piece of software, so it can launch while we're also in here. So we have it over here, this desktop portal. I'm going to push this button brings up the desktop portal window here and I'm going to add a new window and I want to see the twitch chat there it is look at that so let's take a look at the twitch chat settings we can change its size that's probably good anchor none use smooth follow anchor I would like it anchored to my controller. So if I move my controller right there, it's right in front of my controller. But if I put it back right there, I'd like it to be right on top. You can't see this. Um, so just, you know, bear with me. So just, yeah, this is going to be really stupid for a minute. Snap to anchor after distance. I'm sorry, this is super dumb. I'm just trying to make sure that I can get this working in a way that I'll be able to see you. So I need to have it like right here for it to work. All right, H uh, hide at distance. So that's how you do it window cropping left crop 100% that didn't seem to do fucking anything I want it to be there so if I want to see it there you go all right cool so close out of that now I can always see the chat gotta get used to it though right there no, do not quit Half-Life Alex. Okay. Uh, subtitles, only spectator subtitles, subtitles and closed captions, font small, width, wide, speed, medium, volume, uh, character voices. You're getting turned down. I'm getting sick of you, to be honest. Performance. I have it set to medium, but while we're here, textures can stay all... Yeah, yeah. Characters will be low. Flickering lights off. Particles. Audio can be high. Soft cloth off. High quality off. Okay. Alright, so. Can y'all see the game? We can't see. It's in the way. Oh. 
Okay. So can you see it now? All right, now we can actually play it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to our add-ons here and see all the custom add-ons we have installed. Look at all this shit. We're going to make sure the Glock 17 is turned on. I'm going to turn that one off. We're going to go and play a few of these. The first one is a map I played a little bit earlier. I think you're going to like it. Um, it's kind of crazy. You see... Yo. Hey, Tyler. Yo. How are you? Great. Heard Artifact 2 is going to have a pretty good story. Mm. If that's the case, question for you. How the fuck they're going to capture Eel in that game? <laughs> How are they going to capture Eli in Artifact 2? That's a great question. All right, so this map is called uh, Spaceport. It is the port from Halo 3. You start with nothing. All right. Yo. Is Half-Life 3 going to be the continuation of the end of HLA Episode 3 plus more story to make it full game length and not episode length, or are they just going to stretch out an episode's worth of story over 20 episodes? I have no fucking clue. Um, I think it's going to be entirely original if I'm going to be completely honest with you. Alright, so... How does this look? How does this, um... How does this look? Stream look alright? Looks poggers, okay. So, first cool, so we're in the Halo 3, so this is a Halo 3 map. Check this out. Look at this. Look at this shit. Look at this. This is a custom weapon. A completely custom weapon. Completely custom ammo that you just, it animates just fine. And listen, custom sounds. So I can... Isn't that fucking awesome? Oh, this one isn't full anymore. Because I, I pulled the slide back, so there's a bullet in the chamber, yeah. But listen. Oh. It doesn't have its custom sound. Sometimes it doesn't load the sound. Alright, I'm gonna go back to the main menu and try it again, because sometimes it loads the sound, sometimes it doesn't load the sound. And somehow it uses the, the upgrades for the pistol just fine. Like, the guy who made it attached it great. Alright, so we're gonna start a new game at Spaceport with the add-on map. I'm doing it again because I want to make sure I can make sure that works. We're gonna play on hard mode. Let's go. Also, yeah, they don't tell you the ammo count, which I think is funny. Because, like, it's not designed to, like, just be able to shout it out at you. Keep it up, love you. Love you, too. Thank you. There it is! Did you hear that? That's so fucking cool. Okay, how much resin do I got? I got 17. Let's get an upgrade and show that off. Is sex real? No. So let's give it a reflex sight. It's gonna do its thing for a second. Everybody's complaining about lag. Game's playing just fine, which is oh, weird. That really worked, didn't it? Look at that. Huh. Look at that. It works with the upgrades. 
Where's the not safe for work add-ons? Oh, they're coming. If you get what I mean. So the only problem I have with this Glock mod is um, the armor, or the, the these, are really hard to see in the dark. You have anything on you? No. Ammo, not armor. You know what I mean. Uh oh, hey. Whoa! But yeah, this is actually a really good map gameplay wise. They didn't just do nothing with it, which I really appreciate. Oh, damn, that didn't actually hurt me. Bet you feel dumb. You see, part of me was like, oh, you just saw this map because I recorded it for my new video, but my new video isn't out yet. So. Oh. I did just, pl I've, I have already played this one, but I wanted to show it off because I think it's really, really good. Does the gun actually feel or behave different. It does vibrate in a different way, yeah. It feels like a different gun. Ooh. They did a really good job with zombie noises. Yes, they did. So I want to learn... I want somebody to do a V script that replaces all of these fucking puzzles with the cut lockpicking ones. Does anybody know how to do it? Or I could get, just tell the game, hey, instead of putting this in my fucking face, just have me do that real simple lockpicking one, because I am so sick. This is my, like, I have played Half-Life Alex a numerous number of times. This is my least favorite thing out of the entire game, is this fucking sphere puzzle. Ah! <sighs> and whoever designed the map set this to one of the medium settings where you have to do it fucking twice. Why did she hug you, Ta- Fuck! Rotate the sphere and not your multi-tool. Easy. Uh, have you tried the lockpicking minigame? It's so much easier. What are you telling me? Tyler, you don't actually rotate your wrist when using the multi-tool. Just pull the trigger. Uh, you can do both. Ah! Oh, son of a bitch. I hate this so much. I've never had this much problem with one either. So this is, this is a little embarrassing. Oh, thank God. If you like those kind of puzzles, you're an idiot. I will stand by my controversial uh, opinion. You do not know what a good video game is, even if it smacked you in the face. Mm.
Why? Were you considering it? Oh no. Oh good god, no. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. Okay, got to find some more. Got to find some more. Uh-oh. Skedios. Guys, what do I do? Uh oh, and we got a reviver over there. Ouch. Uh, well, helpful, kinda, I guess. Fuck you. Shotgun shells? Where's the. Sh where, did I miss a shotgun? What the hell? Oh, this is. Least favorite enemy in the game, this guy right here. So fucking loud. Oh my goodness. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'll go over here and do another orb puzzle. Oh, there's the shotgun. Come on, come on. There's, there's, there's gotta be. Come on. Oh, the orb puzzle, maybe. Guys, you think maybe the orb puzzle will save me? Yeah, the orb puzzle. This is, yeah. The orb puzzle will save me. Yeah, duh. I'm so good at those. Oh, thank God. Fuck you, dude. Get out of here. This fucking guy wants all the attention. You're the worst guy in the game! No, you better not take over another fucking guy's body. You piece of shit. Get out of here! Jesus. Am I really out? Oh, come on. I am playing on hard, but damn. Alright, hold on. Jesus fucking Christ. Damn. You are overcompensating for something. Wait, did that kill me? Alex? Fuck. Alex. 
All right. I'm going to go to the main menu. We're going to play something else. Just for a little bit. We'll come back to it. How's the stream look now, guys? Show us the crowbar? No. Manage add-ons. All right, let's turn on a new add-on. Let's play... Uh, one I haven't played before. Industrial Exploration. Haven't played that. CSGO Dust 2. Contact confirmed. Inhumane. Quick Stop. Played that. Long Way Out. Played that. I guess it doesn't matter what I've played as long as, you know... On the Run. Combine Tower. The Street. I haven't played The Street before. Let's play The Street. Let's play it on normal difficulty, because we're not idiots. Dust 5? Remember, Twitch Prime's free, you jerks. Always telling me to make Dust 5. You want Dust 5 so bad? You want Dust 5 so bad? Make it yourself. Whoa. That guy's running. I don't got no pistol. There's something up in here? No? Okay. Got some flower pots. We do not have flower pots anymore. Okay, there's a head crab. We need a pistol. We need a pistol. Where are they? Uh, okay. Oh, here it is. How much weapon? I have one bullet. One bullet. Okay. Um, gotta find some of that. You gave me one fucking bullet. Can I pick this up? No. Can I? No. All right. Um. We need dust six now. Uh, I'm Just finished Alex for the first time. Hell yeah. Wasn't it great? Liquid physics. Gotta be some ammo around here. There's some for another weapon. All right, anything in here? No. One left. Yeah. Okay. Well, that guy will leave me alone for a little bit. Anything up in here? No? Anything up in here? No. Okay. This map is called... The Street. It should have been called... Foggy fucking map with no ammo. I think that would be a more realistic title. It is a street. I'll give you that. This is this is a street of some. Oh, hello. Shit. Oop. Zoosh. Zoosh. Hey Tyler, do you think you'll have time to look at something I've been working on for the past few days? It's my first real workshop submission, and feedback would be greatly appreciated. Sure, DM me. Thank you for the donation. I'm not gonna say like, oh, I'll play your map if you donate, but I guess I'll play your map if you donate. Also, I appear to be getting some low FPS on this one, so the optimization might not be complete. So, uh, sorry, it's not the stream, it's actually, it is me. Ugh. Whoa, what? Where? Uh, 
Oh, there's another. Okay. Just making sure I grab everything. People are... Are they firing on me, or...? I can't really tell. Alright. Oh! Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on. There it is. It's gotta be... Oh wow, lots of health in this map. I don't need it yet, but thank you. Oh shh! I need it now! I didn't think I had my pistol out, and I was meaning to grab it with my other hand, and uh, wanted to throw it towards them so I could get a cheap uh, kill. That did not work out. That did not work out. It's actually a decent map. It's actually like just one vertical street, which, yeah, okay, that's really neat. You better save him. Donate now. Donate now or he's getting it. Donate now or he's getting it. Do it. Come on. Three, two, one. TF2 is dead. Was that a donation? I think that was a sub I think that was a subscription. I forget what my sounds are. Ooh, the new wired. Anything out there I could use? No. Okay. <gasps> I bet it's a sphere puzzle. Oh, my favorite. I love these. Anyone ported two for it yet? Ooh, I needed to do that. Okay. Uh oh. Oh my god. Look at all these computer monitors. Oh, they're powered on. That's strange. Come on. Oh my, that took forever. At least he's dead, right? At least he's dead. Get what you deserve if you drink the booze. Don't drink booze, it's bad. Oh shit. I did not sign up for this. I totally missed the shotgun.
Oh boy. Oh, good God. Oh, shit. Oh, my. Uh oh, stinky. Uh oh, stinky. How far back am I? This is the beginning of the map. Let's play something else. Put save points in your maps. Come on, can't be that hard. All right, what else we got? We just played the street. Now we're gonna play uh, The Pit. That's Spaceport, we're gonna play The Pit. Where is The Pit? Okay, we are not going to play The Pit. We're gonna play Alex's Nightmare. Alex's Nightmare. Y'all ready for Alex's Nightmare? Oh, good God. Okay, right into it. Really? Okay. Um. I can't see a goddamn thing. It was on your face and then, oh. Damn, this is something. Okay, I need to find key cards somehow. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> ah, damn, I'm gonna die. God damn it. What's left? Out of shells. Oh, for the love of God. Okay. What's that up there? Oh, pistol ammo. Yeah, there's some. Um... Oh, okay. I got... I don't know what color because everything is fucking red and it's one of those that you can't pocket. Nope, not that one. Nope. 
No. Oh my god, how many fucking doors are there? Oh, it's that one, okay. Oh, cool, it's filled with these guys. Epilepsy warning, oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, why? Three cells left. It's not letting me reload the gun. Last cell. Okay. All right, that's fine. I'm gonna beat this map. I'm gonna save. Oh my god, I can see. Two years. Wow. Oh, two uh, years. Black Mesa coming to steal, though. Oh, wow. That's, that's 2015. That's a long time. See, this map would have been better if you didn't set it so that each zombie produced a head crab. The head crabs are really hard to deal with when you can't fucking see. All right, so I unlocked this door. You think like, can I pick? Maybe yeah, I thought maybe I was fucked up and I could, and maybe I could like pick up. Oh come on, man! How? In the goddamn hell am I supposed to do this? Jesus Christ. That must be all the the, the zombies, and now we're just dealing with head crabs. God damn. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. This is hard. Alright, I'm gonna use this as a guiding light source. Okay. I do not believe that I got everyone. Uh, oh shit, scared me. Let's reload this. One. I dropped one out there, didn't I? Oh my god. Where am I? Oh, are they in the other little rooms? Is there health in here left? Yeah, some. Okay. This seems boring. Um... Yeah, it's not great. Um... Not being able to see anything at all. I will cheat here for just a second and turn on full bright just to see what this looks like. Oh wow. Okay, so those are stop. This is this is at this is how you sit. This is how you hide that you didn't really make anything. Look at this. It's just a big box. Jesus Christ. And we hid that fact by... Are we kidding? Alright, I'm keeping it on until I find the next fucking key card because this is stupid. I thought there was more to it than that. Now I'm just angry that you made a box and hid it. What the hell happened here? What the hell is this? Okay. Uh, 
All right, here's the blue key card. So now I got to turn that off. A blue key card, okay. Nope. See, I can't... Uh, green, no. Blue? It's light blue. Kind of angry that there... Ha Why does there have to be so many? Is this another key card that I just grab? What is this? Yeah, it's... It's the lime green card. I think that's this. Yeah. Alright, so... Oh, that door's unlocked. That's yellow. Must be this one. Alright, let's get ready for a fucking fight. Alright, here we go. Oh, good god. Oh, shit! Don't fucking do that! Oh, my god! Somebody just scared me in real life. See, I already opened one of the doors, and in my head it's like, oh, is there, like, key cards to lead to other doors inside there? But it doesn't seem like it. Alright, so let's go in here. That door... okay. This is so stupid. I can't even tell what I'm... Okay, fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. That one was bad. New game. We're gonna play Emergence. That was doo-doo fart poo-poo head. Pardon my language. <laughs> oh, what happened? Oh, it crashed. Cool. Okay. Oh, shit. Electra gave me a haircut, and uh, she fucked my shit up. And now you see it. <laughs> I forgot. Um, this is what happens when Electra gives you a haircut. Yeah. I'll put a hat on to hide it. Pretend that didn't happen. I'm not doing that, Coolman. Found the Apple Watch, by the way. Uh, yeah, Electra cut my hair. It did not go as planned, but hey, I love her anyway. Um, she also shaved my face. Mallory uh, saw my hair cut and laughed at me. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Yeah, fuck you. Um, 
<laughs> At least she tried. Yeah, I guess. She did try, huh? You guys want to see, uh... Wait, you, you want to see something? What do you want to see? I don't know. Do I have anything cool to show you that I'm comfortable showing right now? How many girlfriends do you have? One. That's Electra's sister. That just walked. That was that was Electra's sister. Okay. Um, I'm really hungry. Um, do I look like way younger when I shave my face? Electra also did my eyebrows, uh, and she said I look my age now. So. I look older? I think you're lying. Oh, man. Oh, another Left 4 Dead 2 update. Um, yeah, uh, this was a quick little thing just to, just to show some stuff off. Uh, I'm 23, by the way. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean... I'm a babby. Yeah, I'm actually trying to take care of myself lately. Um, thank God, am I right? Uh, okay, so current plan for content. And I know it changes all the time, and I know Kuman doesn't like it when I announce shit before I know it's going to be done, but fuck you! I'm going to do it anyway. Um, number one... I just got confirmed. Ju I just checked my email. I got a confirmation on a really fancy sponsorship. Like one of those fancy, schmancy, big ass YouTuber sponsorship type things. Um, okay, so uh, I have a video about the HP Reverb G2 coming tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow morning. That has a sponsorship in it. Um,. I have a video, uh, a content like showcase coming um, very soon. Uh, uh, Half Life Alex Workshop com Community Content Showcase thing. I'd like it to be first of the month, and I think that's Monday. I might be able to get that done for Monday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I have the Steam Cloud uh, video, which I think I'll get done for Sunday. Uh, there's the Steam Cloud service thing partnership there's a lot of stuff going on with steam it's going to be led by steam cloud but then i'm going to group in all the other steam stuff going on um i have it's not raid shadow legends no um it's a cool one it's like an actual one that everybody's like oh okay um the csgo source 2 video is about 70 percent done and I'm setting it for the second week in June. So that's like like two weeks, two-ish, like two weeks from now, yeah. Um, it's not Raycon, no, I don't even know what Raycon is. No, uh, is it App Nana? Um, what else? Uh, there's a big Artifact 2 video coming because I have a build of Artifact 2 um, and I data mined it, and I know pretty much everything that they're working on right now for like the future of the game. Um, and I'm very excited about Artifact 2. Um, and I'm also like, so here's something that I found out about the development of Artifact. Uh, there was a second big update for like the original version of Artifact that people were testing, like community people were testing it um and i wasn't one of those people but apparently there was like this full second update already available to certain testers and community members um with like an entire set of cards um like new uh type of card called uh, mutations which we've talked about i was able to hack that into the game um and then like like extra little features and things. 
um, before they decided like we're done with this version of Artifact, people were playing it and it still exists. It's sitting on people's computers, it's out there. Um, and so in this Artifact video, I'm gonna pitch like, hey, why don't you just, you know, let us play it? Like you have no intention of shipping it as a product, but I know it exists. So why don't you just like, like set that set two as like a beta so that we could see what could have been, you know? Cause there are people that really give a shit about Artifact, the original one and how that game was played like this guy. And I'd love to be able to see those cards. Um, and also like you can data mine some, most of the original set two from um, the build. Um, there was also some kind of like story mode being worked on and stuff. I'm, you know, I would have liked to see what that ended up being. Um, also, what am I working on? Oh, big one. So obviously I'm working on that arcane Half-Life 2 Return to Ravenholm video. And as I've said, uh, I was going to get a video out yesterday on that. Uh, talking about everything that was discussed like full analysis on it going really in depth with like the story and extra things that I may know about the project uh, That's being held off until I do something special, which is um, I got a interview with Danny the guy who actually went and played um, The return to Ravenholm build and Recorded everything so I'm gonna ask him a bunch of questions about his experience of playing that game um, and incorporated into that video. So that's why that video is not out yet. Uh, but that should be out next week. Um, yeah. Bunch, I know why there's no zombie head crabs. I will talk about it as soon as I can. Uh, what else? What else? CSGO Source 2. I have a big TF2, community TF2 thing coming. It's not creators. Uh, creators.tf is working on our next update quite a bit. We're actually, we're, we're kind of like bottlenecked. There's this one massive feature that Moonlee's been pretty much all day working on and he's getting close to finishing that one up. Once that's done, once Moonlee's done with his big massive feature, we're gonna be, oh, that's gonna be great. There's a big thing there. It's not Open Fortress like strictly just Open Fortress. It's the beginner's guide to the TF2 community. So it's gonna be everything. Um, and there's some things that I'm learning about Open Fortress that I'm kind of iffy on. And also, every time I ever mention them in a less than positive light, I get messages with Twitch clips and things. And they have like their own private Discord server that I'm not allowed in that they talk about, you know, what I say in. It's uh, Open, For Open Fortress, the more I learn about them, the little. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's an interesting game for right now, but. They're making some pretty bad decisions. I, whatever. Um, what else? Do I have any insight on Left 4 Dead 2? Oh, there's that um, big Left 4 Dead video that I'm working on. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff. A lot of cool stuff. Um, a good balance of videos that'll take me like a couple hours to make and a couple videos that'll take a week like CSGO Source 2, Beginner's Guide to the TF2 Community, and the Episode 4, or excuse me, the Ravenholm videos are going to take multiple days, and I've been working on all of them already. But then stuff like the Steam Cloud video, that's a day. Um, the Workshop Showcase, that is a day project, you know. Hey, Japanese, Bush, baby, what up? Bray, love ya, love ya. Yeah, so uh, the new HP headset video is done. I've already finished it. It's coming out tomorrow morning. Um, yeah, but I'm hungry. I'm gonna go eat something. Uh, love you guys. Peace and air grease. Uh, hope you guys are alright. I will talk to you later. Uh, bye bye.